plays and the buses because they couldn't go down Constitution or Independence. I always wonder how it is that you stop buses from going on Independence. Isn't that what we celebrated two weeks ago? But it is what it is. A couple of quick pieces. If you are one of the speakers, if you can make your way down here and sit to my left, we want you earlier to the front. Number two is, if you already had lunch, certainly don't take another one because it is a very good lunch, but it's, we have lunches for everyone. Number two is, we're going to begin to start in about three minutes because we have a representative of Congressman Smith here, but I wanted to at least get those announcements out. The other is that we're going to be taking official photographs as well as video of today, uh, all of which will be provided to you later. If you do take photographs, selfies or photographs of speakers or photographs in the room, whatever you do, make sure you share it on social media. We have two hashtags that we're using. In Jay Hill Day, one word. No housing cuts, one word. We got a lot of those messages out on the uh, social media on the way down today. Uh, we need to continue that process. When I was a young child, a thousand years ago, they used to always say, if a tree falls in a forest, you don't hear it. If an event happens in the 21st century and it's not on social media, it did not happen. So keep the messages going, keep the communication out there. But we'll be starting in about three minutes, even though we're gonna have more people coming in as we go. I'm gonna um, ask my friend Stacy Berger to come over. My only friend. It's always good to be in a room with all my only friends at one time in Washington. If you have a friend in Washington, you're the only friend. I've and if I'd known you were wearing blue, I would have worn blue. Well, we didn't even we didn't play that. Either, did we? Oh, that's it. Right. Yeah. No. Raphael. Yeah. Raphael. Yeah. I'm sorry. And Raphael is known. Um, good morning or afternoon. I'm Stacey Berger. I'm the president and CEO of the Housing and Community Development Network of New Jersey. Um, we are thrilled to be partnering with Monarch and a number of other organizations that are um, making today possible. We uh, are looking forward to having a great afternoon talking to legislators about why we need to have no housing cuts. That's hashtag no housing cuts. If it doesn't happen on social media, we're trying to get those in action. It doesn't happen. But I spent my four and a half hours on the bus tweeting and Facebooking, so. Um, and I, I followed every one of them. I know you did, and Rich is my only follower. Um, <laughs> So I'm just going to, I don't know what you covered because it took us a little while to find our way through the building, but I'm um, just going to say a couple of quick things about the network. We're the statewide association of nonprofit housing developers. So we work um, in communities and with constituencies to make sure that everybody has a safe, great place they can afford to call home. And we are going to help deliver that message here today on the Hill and always back in New Jersey. Um, one of the things I always tell people when they meet with legislators is they work for you. They, they, you pay taxes, they are, they, this is their responsibility to come talk to you and to listen to your stories. And they're human beings just like you are, so they want to be treated with respect and, and, and confident. And you should feel confident in telling your story because they want to hear that. That's what they came to Washington to do, and it's our job to help them do their job. So I always tell people at legislative days, are your elected officials putting their pants and their pantyhose on one at a time just like you do? They're not any different than you are. Treat them um, with the same amount of respect and information that you would like to get if you were in their shoes. If you don't have an answer to a question that you get asked, that's okay. The best thing you can say is, that's not, I don't know the answer to that, but we'll get back to you. And that gives you a good reason to follow up with them either here at On the Hill or back in the district. So um, we are thrilled to be here and be able to help, and um, I'll stop talking. Now. Yeah, we're going to take like a two-minute break just to check the logistics, and then we'll be back. Okay. okay.